Welcome to AutoCAD Learning. In this session, we will learn about basic 3D modeling tools and their uses, and we will draw something with it. So, uh, for the starting, we have to check about the workspace setting. It is in 3D modeling, so it's okay. Next, we will change our visual style to southeast isometric. We will change our visual style to southeast isometric. The visual style is changed. Uh, we will pan the origin point towards a bit left so that we can get the total positive plane over here. Okay. Now, let's start with uh, the basic tool that is a 3D solid creation box or box creation. So, just click on the box or the command is box. Click on the box on the ribbon. In this case, we have to specify the first corner point, the another corner point or the dimension of the length and width. I am putting the dimension of the length and width. Uh, I am giving the width of 15 and length of 20. Okay. And after that, it will ask for the height. I am giving the height of 5. So, I have created a box like structure. Just pan a bit to view it properly. This is the box like structure we have created already. So, for the start we have created box and we have learned how to create a box. So, for the creation of box just click on the first point, first corner point and then click on the another corner point in the diagonal or just give the length and width value and after that you have to specify the height or any other corner point so that it can make the total box shape so the three things have been given the first corner point length and width and the height so we have created a box it's very easy uh, number two thing that we want to do uh, because uh, if we have to do something like uh, another shape that is not exactly like box then we will need another tool that box tool will not uh, help us because it helps with the rectangular shape so for that uh, we need another tool called extrude for using extrude we need a surface area of any shape so i am taking a uh, polygon uh, i am taking a rectangular shape first just i am i have made a rectangular shape and at one side of it I am making a circle and after that I can just uh, trim it out I can just trim the portion out to get the desirable shape what I want ok so this is the shape what I want just join the shape and I got the total surface here. So, bounded uh, surface here I got it. So, for that this is this cannot be done by the box tool. So, for this we will need the extrude tool. For extrude just click on the bounded shape and go to extrude. It will just ask for the height and the direction if we want in the minus direction downward direction then just drag the mouse to the downward or if we want it in the upward direction just drag the mouse to the upward I'm giving the height to be 10 so I have done it by doing the extrude option so for the extrude option what will we need we need a shape to extrude to the body or the model and after that just select the shape and then click on the extrude so we can in this way we can make the solid by extrude I'm clearing it the next option is called a press pull option this is the press pull tool 
it actually uh, presses or pulls a defined surface area towards the body. Uh, it can pull the body out or it can pull the surface out from the body or it can push the surface into the body to make a slot like structure. Just uh, we, uh, we are going to see, uh, just I am creating another box here. Just create a box and give the height uh, any arbitrary. Uh, I am giving it uh, up to 15 let us say. And then uh, just pan it to its surface. For better understanding I am changing the visual style to realistic. So that we can see what is happening actually. So, in the realistic view we can see it uh, the bo box has been made. After that I am making a circle structure on the top surface of the box. I have made a circle. I am making a rectangular structure at another side on the top of the box just like that. I am making a polygon of 5 sides that is the pentagon. Let us say inside in a circle and I have made the pentagon here and ok these 3 structures are ok no problem. So, just do with it with the press pull. Uh, for the press pull just click on the press pull tool or give the command P R E S S P U L. So, just click on it after that go to any bounded area. This is another bounded area by the bounded by the rectangle this is the bounded area bounded by the circle and this is the bounded area bounded by the pentagonal structure. And in between that this is a bounded, bounded region bounded by the rectangular uh, surface and the circle the rectangle and the pentagon on it. So, just go to the pentagonal structure I want to pull it upward. So, I pull it up to a 5, I want to press this rectangle structure downward up to a 5. So, it make a slot and pull it up to a 10, pull this circular structure up to a 10 to make a column. Just check it out how the things are actually. You can see easily that the in the realistic view I can change the view to uh, any other just uh, I am checking out sets of grey. So, you can see that uh, this is the column like structure from the box we have made. Uh, we can we have made a rectangular slot over here and a pentagonal structure upward. So, we have done about the press pull tool also. Uh, change the visual style to the normal 2D wireframe ok. And we are in southeast isometric, no problem. We are in southeast isometric. The next thing we are going to do is uh, for the poly solid, click on it. In the poly solid, we can make 3D walls. So, for this first point, just click on here, and after that, it will make for the next point at any angle, you can bend it over here. I can make it a bend over here at any angle just it makes a wall. So, from here after that here after that here and like we have seen in the line tool we can also close or make a arc of it. So, I am putting a close over here to close the wall. So, with the poly solid we can make a wall. So, this is all about the 3D modeling basic things. We have learned about box, about extrude tool, about press pull tool and uh, pressing it towards a body or pulling it out to make a column like structure or something and making walls by the poly solid. Thank you for watching. We will see you in the next video.